Hard rock miners would sink shafts in order to extract gold from the quartz rock. Drilling was either by hand or through the use of compressed air drills with the help of a little dynamite. Hydraulic drills were the next evolution, and these helped open up deeper holes in the Earth's surface, using drill bits which became longer and thinner the further they went down. Larger rocks extracted from the mines were crushed by heavy iron stamping machines to release the gold from the surrounding rock. Hydraulic mining used high-pressure jets of water to displace the rock and soil and open up the gold beneath. High in the hills, water was diverted into ditches and through heavy iron pipes. As the water channeled down, gravity increased its pressure and as that pressure reached around 5,000 pounds per square inch, it was pushed through a small nozzle and used to blast the mountains apart. The displaced soil cascaded down the valley and was diverted into sluices where it would be separated. This new mining technique, while productive, was not without cost, however, as diverting all that water caused huge flooding in the valleys below, devastating farmland. As a solution to this problem in California, miners turned to dredging, which worked like a vacuum cleaner, sucking up the material underwater and running it through a sluice to sift out the gold. 